been more than a month now since 29-year-old Katie Miller disappeared. The Dartmouth woman's family has worked tirelessly to try and find her. Today, with the help of volunteers, they plastered her neighborhood with posters and information cards in hopes it will bring about some clues. Global's Lucy Edwardson reports. Today, John Miller, the father of missing Dartmouth woman Katie Miller, held a poster campaign through North Dartmouth in hopes of gaining information that could lead to finding his daughter. John says that as the days pass, not knowing the whereabouts of his daughter has become increasingly difficult on the family. But things like the poster campaign help them remain focused on finding Katie. As every week goes by, it gets a little tougher. Uh, it helps to be uh, going out and doing what you can do. Uh, it gives you something to do and uh, you um, keeps you sane, uh, doing everything that you can do, shall we say. Uh, and so we'll, we'll keep on going. Um, it gets a little tougher uh, each week. Family, friends and complete strangers volunteered their time today passing out flyers, hanging posters and slipping information cards under doors. They focused on the building where Katie lives. Lisa Webb has never met Katie before, but as a family member of Loretta Saunders, she felt compelled to help the Miller family in a situation she understands all too well. We know what it's like when you have, when you try to go to bed at night and you're thinking, you know, where could they be? And you get up in the morning and you're wondering what's today going to bring. Those who volunteer today say they have one goal. Hope to find Katie or at least find a lead that will help us find Katie. This Tuesday will mark five weeks since Katie Miller's disappearance. Her family urges anyone with any information to contact the police or Crime Stoppers. Lucy Edwardson, Global News, Dartmouth.